So let's look at 2021, uh, 2022 paper 1, a question on trigonometry. It says, uh, in the diagram, F, F, G, H is a straight line. As you can see, F, G, F is a straight line. Then, in this same diagram, they are saying uh, F, G. From F to G, this is what? 8 centimeters. So, F, G is 8 centimeters. Then, E, G. Where is E, G? E, G is 10 centimeters. And angle, E, F, G is 90 degrees. Very good. E, F, G is 90 degrees. So, this is our 90 degrees here. Yeah? Okay? So, this uh, type of triangle is called a right angle triangle because it has an interior angle of 90 degrees. Okay? Now, we have two sides. This side and this side. This one is 10 centimeters and this one is what? 8 centimeters. Then the third side, we are not given. Okay? So, since this is a right angle triangle, the longest side is the hypotenuse. And if the hypotenuse is uh, 10, then the other one is what? 8. This one becomes what? 6. So this is uh, 6 centimeters. Where is the 6 coming from? We can find uh, this 6 by using Pythagoras theorem. So let me just show you where I got this 6 from. So let's find uh, EF. Okay? So EF is saying 6 centimeters. So where did I get the 6 centimeters from? So you say uh, EF. EF is equal to square root of this one, you can say a 10 squared, which is the longest side, the hypotenuse, 10 squared minus this other one, which is 88 squared. So EF is equal to square root, a 10 squared is the same as 10 times 10 minus 8 squared is 8 times 8. So E F equals square root 10 times 10 get 100 minus 8 times 8 get 64. So E F E F is equal to square root of 100 minus 64 get 80. That's 6. So E F is equal to what is the square root of uh, 36? It's 6. Okay. So this is uh, the 6 uh, centimeters. So I say uh, EF is what? As uh, 6 uh, centimeters. Now, the question is saying uh, find the value of sine EGF. Sine EGF. So they're talking about angle G. This angle Y. So angle G, this is our reference angle. This is our angle of reference. This is our reference angle. Okay? So this. Angle G is our reference angle. The side opposite to this side becomes the opposite. Any side is opposite to the reference angle becomes the word opposite. So the side opposite to this reference uh, angle becomes the opposite. So this is our opposite. Opposite. Then if this is 90 degrees, the side opposite to this 90 degrees is the what? The IPO, the hypotenuse. So this is our hypotenuse. Then this is our opposite, which is the side opposite to the reference, uh, reference angle because we are focusing on angle EG, EGH, which is angle GI. Okay? Now, they want us to find sine, sine EGF. So we know when we go back to Sogatoa, uh, when we go back to Sogatoa, we know so ka. To you say sine theta is equal to opposite over hypotenuse that is so okay then ka cos theta equals adjacent divided by the hypotenuse okay then to okay so tangent tan theta is equal to opposite over adjacent. Okay? Now, in this case, which one are we uh, focusing on? We are focusing on this one, sine A. Okay? This is our area of interest. So, this is what we are going to use to find uh, sine 
EGH. Okay, so we're going to say sign E G H is equal to we know sine theta is E G H. So opposite say opposite over over hypotenuse. Okay, so is equal to what is our opposite? Six. So six over what is our hypotenuse? It's 10. So 6 over 10, or you can also reduce it and say 2 into 6 is 3, then 2 into 10 is 5. So this is our, this is our answer. Okay. Come on. Shameful.